Hi guys, it's Liz from Little Homestead on the Hill and today I thought I would show you my haul. So I went to Walmart, to Food Lion, to GNC, and to the Dollar Tree. So let's start, there's a lot of stuff. Went to Food Lion and I spent uh, $67 right there. So I ended up getting red potatoes, some lemons, some limes, some carrots, a big thing of strawberries some gluten-free Bisquick, onions, cabbage, some soda for the husband, and, oh, some mason jars. I actually got some pints and I got some quarts, which I'm so excited because I have not seen quarts in a long time. So then we went to Walmart and I spent $136.54 at Walmart. So I got some bagels for the kiddo and the husband, some walnuts, some honey, some gluten-free bread, some gluten-free cornbread, some gluten-free swirl, some swirl, some cheeseburger, hamburger helper, but I don't get that too much, but it is nice when you don't want to cook and it's there. We got some chicken dipping sauce because I heard that's supposed to be like um, the Chick-fil-A sauce. Some secret sauce for, it's kind of like what's on your Big Macs. Two cans of tuna, some zote soap to make um, homemade laundry soap. Some turkey breast, some um, whipping cream, a pork filon, for lo a pork loin filet, duh. <laughs> some corned beef, um, provolone cheese, pepper jack cheese, some pickle loaf, I love that so much, some vodka sauce. I got some boneless um, skinless chicken and a pack of um, pork chops, some minced garlic, some cream cheese. K cup coffee and then I got me some caramel macchiato because I need it all the time <laughs> some whole milk to make yogurt two more a gallon of two percent and a half gallon of two percent and some half and half some dishwasher pods some Folgers black silk really good I got some um, three pounds of ground chuck 80 percent two bags of cat litter so I think that's it for Walmart, yes. And then we will go to the Dollar Tree. So I got some me Mia, that's mama's purse. She's a silly cat. So then I got some scrubbies for this. I've not tried this yet, so I'm interested. And for a dollar, why not? Another Brillo for the bathtub, some Brillo Basics, tape. I always need tape. Got some hamburger deal chips. Some olives, some relish, two bags of long green white rice, some black beans. Then I got some little tiny containers right here, which I love doing things with these. Then I got these. These are craft beef storage, but actually I'm going to put herbs in them. So, and that was it. I th It was like $17 I think I spent at the dollar store. Yeah. So this is it. really simple we're gonna make some sweet potato slips so all you need is some mason jars some toothpicks some toothpicks and some sweet potatoes simple 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 first thing you're gonna do is gonna, you, the sweet potato needs to be in the jar 
so like mm, halfway so you want to find that halfway point and then you want to put some um, toothpicks on it so usually three is all you need see just like that simple simple so let's do some more that looks good for that one And there we go. Actually, this is probably going to get four because it's it's weird shaped. And then we're going to put it in. So there's two. And will this one fit in there? Nope. But that one will. Let's see. So we'll put it here. And here. In there and put that one in so now I'm going to add some water to these just to where the sweet potato is a little bit more so there's one <laughs> okay don't be like me and make a mess there's two let me fill this back up And it's best to use organic um, sweet potatoes. So you pretty much have to use organic sweet potatoes. See, and there's that one. I just gotta add a little bit more water to this one. Just like that. So where we want it to go. Right there looks good. In just like that. Very simple. Actually, I'm going to add a little bit more water to this one. And there you go. Simple. So what you're going to do is you're going to put these in a sunny window. And it takes four to six weeks for the slits. Or the slits. Yeah, the slits. Is it the slits? Yeah, the slips. I'm losing my mind to start growing you'll see it start growing in the bottom and you'll see it start growing in the top every once in a while you want to take this out and you do want to change the water and it's that simple once you get this and you want to start this now because spring is here and it's almost time to plant so another little tidbit for you